right, so sorry I couldn't get back to you earlier. So the length here is 12 feet to the middle of the rubber. Well, actually, that's the hard part. So that's 12 feet. And then see how wide it is. And from what's the inside? So let's go inside. from the inside of that to there is uh, 51 and a half or 52 inches. The 12 foot from the back was to the front of this panel down here. And this, this is not mounted. And then uh, this shelf here is about, uh, what is that? About 20 inches, so 21 inches, something like that. So, but that's not all the way to the here. This is six inches. So 21 minus six is 15 inches. So 12 feet plus 15 inches is how long you have to this front bulkhead where you have a window there's, there's no glass here and that goes into the front of the cab the cabin where the driver is By, tw by 23 and on the left you've got this other cabinet which is about 23 wide to that black bead and then you've got this other counter that's about 20 and these two counters are about 24 to 25 inches tall this side door is about uh, let's say about 30 inches on the inside 30 inches of an opening and about 67 inches tall there's like a drop down in the floor right in front of that door and that is about nine inches deep 15 inches wide and about 32 and a half width the ceiling the floor to the ceiling is six foot exactly 72 inches and that's to the padding so that's why when i stand up right i hit my head on the padding but there is all these lights they're a little bit lower as well on the ceiling the rear door is about uh, 60 and a half inches tall. The, the deck is about 28 inches off the ground. The outside of the vehicle is maybe 8 foot 1. Probably right about 8 feet. And the length of the box is 14 feet long. So it's 14 by 8. You also wanted to see the inside a little better. Um, yeah, it's dirty, but you just have to spend your time cleaning it and changing the carpets and and the seats and Not your it's not up to your standards. That's for sure But I know you can clean it up and fix it up um, It does have cruise control. I believe I, yep, I didn't try it um, It's got a lot of buttons in here um, yeah, I don't know anything about it. Also has shows the amps and volts here. This is the siren controller, I think. I'm not sure, but I think. And uh, there's also a mic microphone on it. Um, the radio is just a standard Ford radio. It's, it says it's equipped with APC auto throttle. With engine running, gear selector in park, set the parking brake. So it probably ramps up to adjust for voltage or something. It's got some lights on the ceiling. Um, really not much to see in here other than 
the back, which I think you wanted to see that. And uh, so here's the the window, and uh, there's a, a spotlight there, and there's a the carpet in the ground here down there. So you're gonna want to build like a crawl through and get rid of this whole center console, most likely. Well, I hope that was uh, a satisfactory walkthrough for you. There is a cool visor on there. <laughs> and some lights up top.